Burma State Emergency and Management Agency Executive Secretary James Ayopu has suspended a biometric exercise in the Goma camp of the International Organization for Migration, IOM, and UNHCR due to alleged hoodlum attacks on IOM and UNHCR staff. The exercise has been conducted to determine the number of households displaced and to maintain calmness. Uh, this is one of the steps for the settlement plan of the governor of Burma State. And uh, when uh, the team was in Dabdu, uh, there was this allegation that uh, the talking, the talking is the, 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 the how to profile household, household by household, and get them a ticket. They call the ticket talking. So when the ticket was given to uh, most of the traditional rulers, they will, they will come with their, the, with their list that the token should be given to them. The IDPs allege that they will now give this thing to some people to come and say to them. So there was a massive protest. And then the youth used the advantage of the, the protest by these women who were being demanded to pay some certain amount of money before they will be registered. And the youth stopped their own team from working. They even smashed some of their equipment, asked them to withdraw from the camp for their safety. He however noted his aim to determine IDP data for timely resettlement plans with 19 out of 23 local government areas and marked for the biometric exercise. The biometric exercise is to, to identify those people who were displaced, know them, have a verifiable data. When you, these people are known, we know the number of people who are displaced, where they come from, and then it will help us to plan for their settlement. For now, we have suspended the activities of the exercise in Goma for the meantime. But they don't know the, what they are going to lose when we, the, the team, the RM, will withdraw the exercise. Although we have, have begged them not to, to worry, we are going to take measures for their safety and then we we'll continue with the exercise. Benway is going to gain from it maximally. When we get that uh, the verifiable data, the government will commence the process of the settlement. I only appeal to them. I really didn't know what the governor wanted to do for them. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.